if we come to live here and it's just going to work, it's, it's for something. Can you say that again, man, what he said? Like where the little fucking hamburgers, mate. Yeah. <laughs> what would you ask Clive Palmer? I'd ask him how it feels to make billions of dollars of the blood and annihilation of a culture that had been here for 200,000 years. Yeah, or, you know, you're so how it feels to it. sell slavery to your people pretending it's good, like electricity. He's yeah. trying to get them to fix the beaches. He got front page coverage in the fucking Gold Coast Bulletin. Going, oh, we want to fix our beach. We want money to fix our beaches. Aren't you a fucking billionaire, Clive? You don't want money from the government. We want a fucking, instead of subsidies for your stupid mining company, we want your money to fix our beaches, which are fucking falling apart because of your mining company. Exactly. You big fucking fat dickhead. You might be to try and reopen all the sand mines because you're always going to get the sand to repair all these beaches. I don't know, but that, that, that blew my head off just because... His actual industry is doing it, and he wants money from the government when he's gotten, getting subsidies from the government that should be going to the people. Exactly. And they complain money. about doll bludgers. These guys get $44 billion fucking dollars a year. Tax free. Tax free, they're getting your money, mate. Taxpayers' money. I'd like to say that to Clive Palmer. Hey, buddy, give us some of your $44 billion and stop whinging about doll bludgers, you fat fucking lion prick. And while you're at it, uh, stop bribing all the governments and all the uh, newspapers with all your lying uh, journalist friends who are basically nothing more than paid dog scavengers on the bones of humanity as it dies and burns into a history of hell created by your mining companies. What are your hands, Jack? They are black from the coal. What is your back, Jack? Black from the blood you stole. Yeah, don't get me started about Clive Palmer, man. He's got a big, big sign at Delagal. Oh, Christ. There's a joke there, too, about Mr. Palmer and five lovely daughters. Yeah, well, I mean, he, he needs to lose a fair bit of weight, eh? He's not really rich. The word wealth, it comes from health. And that fat fucking prick is not healthy. Hey, Maybe he's got a sense of humor, eh? If this gets back to him, he'll be pissed. It's like it's a fictional, fictional movie about time travelers coming back and forth in time to save the human race from complete destruction. They say there's no climate change, but fix our beaches, Clive, on the Gold Coast. That's because there's climate change, mate. Anyway, this video is too long. So, over and out. Yeah, and half our ice caps have melted so much that our beaches on the Gold Coast are falling apart. But no climate change there, Clive, or tiny bloody abbot for a blabbered head. What a wanker. Oh.